Hello, my name is Michael Keneally and this is video four for our September 2021 Star Wheel Astrology and Healing Newsletter. Look at the September page on our Star Wheel website for a list of all the videos and wonderful blogs. And indeed there is a special blog for the astrology of September which unifies the information in all the videos. Now this video 4 is about Mercury. Mercury transits Vedic Virgo for most of September, just enters Libra at the end, then turns retrograde at the very end of the month. So here's the detail. Mercury starts the month of September at 9 degrees Vedic Virgo. Thus he is exalted and powerful in the sign he rules. And Mercury transits Virgo up to the 22nd of September, when Mercury enters Libra. Indeed, to join Venus, where Venus is exalted in the sign he rules, Libra. And in the blog, I've put um, a dignity graph to show you out of interest the super high dignity that Mercury takes on from the 27th of September. Now, the Mercury in Virgo energy up to the 22nd of September, we need to realise, will be analytic and intelligent at its best, systematic, potentially polished and refined, discriminating, but may think too much. Watch out for that. By contrast, the brief Mercury-Venus in Libra combination will be diplomatic and pleasing. A beautiful voice. Indeed, Mars and Sun, who are getting on terribly badly, are left behind back in the sign of Virgo, irritating each other, not affecting Mercury or Venus. But it's important to note that the new Mercury-Venus combination in Libra does not last long. Mercury actually turns retrograde on the 27th of September, five days after entering Libra. And it's still only at one degree Libra that day. Mercury retrogrades back into Virgo, entering Virgo on the 2nd of October. Mercury finally turns direct again on the 18th of October at 15 degrees Virgo, not getting back into Libra until the 2nd of November. So essentially this upcoming Mercury retrograde, note this, is a Mercury retrograde mainly in Virgo. So what life area will this Mercury in Virgo transit be for you? Um, so life air is described by the houses in our Vedic birth chart and to look up for the meaning of um, what house uh, Virgo can be, there's a beautiful description of each house on our Star Wheel Astrology website page. So, for example, if you have Cancer Ascendant, it will be your third house of creative effort and siblings. How will the intelligent, analytic, communicative um, Mercury and Virgo energy affect your creative effort and possibly sibling issues? To simplify. Um, but of course there's also the nature of the sign Virgo itself. Virgo is essentially about health, healing and right living. And, and so what we do could well have a healing dimension to it. Look out for that, maximising it if you identify it. And of course at this time of the residue of coronavirus and indeed the unfortunate new forms that are cropping up, the variants, could it be that our countries will use these analytic skills to further healing and combating the spawning of the virus? 
could be quite decisive. There could quite possibly be a sort of peak between now and mid-September and then some breakthroughs in management. Now in terms of the nakshatras, the wonderful, supremely wonderful 27 signed lunar zodiac of Vedic astrology, Mercury starts September in Uttara Palguni nakshatra which is very social and then enters Hasta nakshatra on the 2nd of September um, so Hasta is about dexterity of hand, you know, and can be applied in many, many positive and negative ways. Entering Chitra Nakshatra on the 13th of September, super creative Chitra. And then Mercury actually re turns retrograde in the Libra, second half of Chitra, on September the 27th, and so enters the ends the month of September in Chitra and Chitra is super about creativity it's ruled by Mars so it's creative effort it's ruled by Vishvakarma the heavenly architect and so Chitras will get super mercurial by the end of the month if you'd like a reading from me about the September astrology in your natal chart or your year ahead please do get in touch with me using the by page of my Star Wheel Astrology website. And as I said, look up the links to all the videos for September and the, all the blogs, the wonderful blogs for our Star Wheel Astrology and Healing newsletter in September on the uh, September page of our Star Wheel website, Star Wheel Astrology website. Thanks very much.